Welcome, nature enthusiasts, to another thrilling episode of Wild Wonder. Today, we're delving into the hidden world of badgers, the enigmatic creatures that roam beneath our feet. Badgers inhabit a wide range of habitats, including woodlands, grasslands, and scrublands, but are most commonly associated with underground burrow systems in open fields and meadows. These elusive mammals are primarily nocturnal, emerging from their burrows at dusk to forage for food under the cover of darkness, making them difficult to observe in the wild. Badgers are skilled excavators, using their powerful claws and muscular bodies to dig intricate burrow systems known as sets, which can extend several meters underground and contain multiple entrances and chambers. Badgers are opportunistic feeders with a diverse diet that includes earthworms, insects, small mammals, fruits, roots, and carrion, making them important contributors to ecosystem dynamics and nutrient cycling. Badgers use scent marking to communicate with other members of their social group and delineate territory boundaries, employing specialized scent glands located near their anus and on their paws. Badgers live in hierarchical social groups known as clans, consisting of a dominant breeding pair and their offspring from previous years which cooperate to defend territory and raise young. Badgers typically mate in late winter or early spring, with females giving birth to litters of one to five cubs in underground dens known as natal chambers, where they are nurtured and protected by their mother. Badger cubs are born blind, deaf and helpless, relying entirely on their mother for warmth, nourishment, and protection during the vulnerable early stages of development. Within badger clans, all members contribute to the care and upbringing of the young, with older siblings and non-breeding adults assisting in cub rearing and education. Badgers communicate through a variety of vocalizations, including growls, snarls, and grunts, which they use to convey dominance, aggression, submission, and other social cues within their clan. Despite their reputation as docile creatures, badgers are skilled hunters capable of taking down prey much larger than themselves using ambush tactics and powerful jaws to dispatch their victims. In regions with harsh winters, badgers may enter a state of torpor known as hibernation, during which they reduce metabolic activity and conserve energy by retreating to the warmth of their burrows. In the wild, Badgers typically live for 6 to 10 years, although some individuals have been known to reach ages of 15 years or more under favorable conditions with access to abundant food and shelter. Badgers have dense, water-resistant fur coats that provide insulation and protection from the elements, allowing them to withstand cold temperatures and adverse weather conditions. When threatened, badgers may emit loud vocalizations, release musky odors from their anal glands, and display aggressive behaviors such as lunging, snarling, and biting to deter potential predators. It's quiz time, nature enthusiasts. What is the primary food source for badgers? Is it A, insects, B, fruits, or C, earthworms? Take your best guess. Badgers can excavate burrows with impressive speed and efficiency using their strong forelimbs and sharp claws to dig through compacted soil and roots with ease. The size of a badger's territory can vary depending on factors such as food, availability, and population density, with some individuals occupying areas as large as several square kilometers. In captivity, badgers have been known to live much longer than their wild counterparts, with some individuals reaching ages of 20 years or more under proper care and management. The fur coloration of badgers can vary widely depending on their geographic location and subspecies with common variations including shades of grey, black, brown and white. As winter gives way to spring, badgers become more active, spending longer periods above ground in search of mates, territory maintenance and food gathering. Within a badger clan, Dominance hierarchies exist, with older, larger individuals typically occupying higher-ranking positions and exerting influence over subordinate members. Badger sets often have multiple entrances and exits, providing the inhabitants with alternative escape routes in case of danger or intrusion by predators. Badgers use scent trails to navigate their territories and locate resources, depositing secretions from their anal glands along well-traveled pathways and boundary markings, 
Badgers in colder regions may have thicker fur coats and larger body sizes to help them retain heat and survive harsh winter conditions. Badgers may form symbiotic relationships with other animals, such as certain species of birds or rodents, which benefit from the protection of the badger's burrow in exchange for providing early warning signals of approaching danger. During periods of food scarcity or inclement weather, badgers may enter short-term torpid states, reducing their metabolic rate and conserving energy until conditions improve. Badgers play an important role in ecosystem dynamics by aerating soil, controlling insect populations, and facilitating nutrient cycling through their burrowing activities. Scent marking is a crucial form of communication among badgers, conveying information about identity, reproductive status, and territorial ownership to conspecifics. Badgers often deposit feces, known as latrines, at specific locations within their territories, serving as olfactory signposts to deter intruders and maintain social cohesion. Badgers hold cultural significance in many societies, appearing in folklore, mythology, and literature as symbols of wisdom, tenacity, and perseverance in the face of adversity. Badgers produce a range of vocalizations, including snuffles, grunts, and barks, which they use to communicate with clan members and express emotions such as agitation or contentment. Badgers are considered ecological engineers due to their role in modifying landscapes through burrowing activities, creating microhabitats that benefit a variety of plant and animal species. When constructing their burrows, badgers select nesting materials such as dry grasses, leaves, and mosses to line the chambers where they rest and rear their young. Badgers maintain the cleanliness of their latrines by regularly covering fecal deposits with soil or vegetation, reducing odors and preventing the buildup of pathogens within their territories. In preparation for winter hibernation, badgers may accumulate fat reserves during the autumn months by consuming large quantities of high-energy foods such as nuts, seeds, and fruits. Intraspecific aggression among badgers is relatively common, particularly during the breeding season when competition for mates and territory intensifies, leading to confrontations and displays of dominance. Badgers groom themselves regularly to remove ectoparasites such as fleas, ticks, and lice, using their teeth and claws to meticulously clean their fur and skin. Although small and inconspicuous, the tail of a badger serves as a signaling device, communicating emotional states and intentions through subtle movements and positioning. Fossil evidence suggests that badgers have existed for millions of years, with ancient relatives of modern species appearing in paleontological records dating back to the Miocene epoch. Population densities of badgers can vary widely depending on factors such as habitat quality and availability of food resources, with higher densities often observed in areas with abundant prey and suitable burrowing conditions. When pursued by predators or threatened by humans, badgers may employ evasive strategies such as rapid digging. Answer to the quiz. The correct answer is C. Earthworms. Badgers primarily feed on earthworms, which make up a significant portion of their diet. As we conclude our exploration of badgers, we've uncovered the secrets of these elusive mammals that dwell beneath the Earth's surface. Join us next time on Wild Wonder for more captivating encounters with the wonders of the natural world. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to our podcast for more wild discoveries. Until then, Keep exploring with curiosity and appreciation for the extraordinary creatures that inhabit our planet.